The Do Something Day by Joe Lasker. Bernie wanted to help. It was a sparkling, sunny, do something day. His father said, not now, Bernie. I've got to make these plans for tomorrow. His mother said, not now, Bernie. I have to finish these signs for tomorrow. His brother said, not now, Bernie. I'm working on my costume for tomorrow. Bernie got mad. No one needs me. I'm going to run away. He left the house and went down the street. On the way, he passed Carl's garage. Hello, Bernie, said Carl from underneath a car. Where are you going in such a hurry? I'm running away, said Bernie. No one wants my help and no one needs me. Well, I need your help, said Carl, still under the car. Can you tell me when these headlights go on and off? And as Carl worked on the wires and buttons, Bernie said, now the lights are on. Now they're off. Oh, now they're on. Carl crawled out and stood up. Thanks for helping me fix the car, Bernie. So you know you're, where you're running to. Here's a great big folded road map for you. Bernie walked on with his great big folded road map. Further up the street, he came to Dimple's Delicatessen. Mr. Dimple was standing in his window, hanging up salamis. Hello, Bernie, he said. Where are you going in such a hurry? I'm running away, said Bernie. No one wants my help and no one needs me. Well, I need your help, said Mr. Dimple. Please hand me those salamis. When all the salamis had been hung up, Mr. Dimple climbed down from the window. Thank you for helping me, Bernie. Here's a nice salami and a sour pickle to eat on the way. So Bernie walked on with his great big folded road map and his nice salami and sour pickle. One block further, he came to Bertha's bakery. Bernie liked Bertha's bakery because it smelled like fresh bread and cookies. Bernie went inside. I've come to say goodbye, Bertha. I'm running away. No one wants my help and no one needs me. Well, I need your help, said Bertha. Can you stamp these dates on the paper bags, then stack them up on there on the shelf? Bernie stamped and stamped and stacked and stacked. And when he would finish, Bertha said, thank you so much for your help. Here's a warm rye bread to go with your nice salami and some cookies for dessert. Bernie walked on with his great big folded road map, his nice salami and sour pickle, and his warm rye bread and cookies. Turning left one block, he came to Pfeffer's fresh produce. Hello, Bernie, said Mr. Pfeffer. Where are you going in such a hurry? I'm running away, said Bernie. No one wants my help and no one needs me. Well, I need your help, said Mr. Pfeffer. Could you please fetch water for my thirsty horse? He handed Bernie a pail. Bernie took it and filled it up at Carl's garage. The horse swished his tail from side to side. My horse Orson thanks you, and I thank you, said Mr. Pfeffer. You'll get thirsty on the road. Here's four pl purple plums and a bunch of green grapes. So Bernie walked on with his great big folded road map, nice salami and sour pickle, warm rye bread and cookies, his four purple plums and a bunch of green grapes. Turning one block left and one block right, he passed Tom's shoe repair. Tom tapped on his window and motioned Bernie to come inside. Where are you going in such a hurry, asked Tom. I'm running away, said Bernie. No one wants my help and no one needs me. Well, I'd like your help, said Tom. Could you please deliver this shoes to Bertha the baker? When Bernie returned from his errand, Tom said, thank you, Bernie. Here's a pair of high button shoes. They're out of style, but they'll keep your feet warm when it's cold on the road. So Bernie worked up, walked on with his great big folded road map, his nice salami and sour pickle, his warm rye bread and cookies, his four purple plums and bunch of green grapes, and his pair of high button shoes. Two blocks further on was Bird's pet shop. Bernie went inside. I've come to say goodbye, Mr. Bird, Mrs. Bird. I'm running away. No one wants my help and no one needs me. I need your help, said Mrs. Bird. Please feed all the fish and birds while I feed the puppies and kittens. So Bernie went from tank to tank feeding fish. Then he went from cage to cage feeding all the birds. And after all the pets had been fed, Mrs. Bird said, My fish thank you, my birds thank you, and I thank you. You always wanted a dog. Here's another runaway. He's looking for a home and wandered in here. But he's a mutt, so I can't sell him. 
but he'll protect you on the road. I'll name my mutt Mutt, said Bernie. Sir Bernie walked on with his great big folded road map, his nice salami and sour pickle, his warm rye bread and cookies, his four purple plums and bunch of green grapes, a pair of high button shoes, and his mutt named Mutt. He walked on and on a little further until he was so tired and he sat down to rest. Meanwhile, the golden sun was sinking lower in the sky. Long shadows crept across the street and up the sides of houses. The do-something day was coming to an end. Soon it would be dark. They all needed me, and they all wanted my help, thought Bernie with satisfaction. He looked at his things and had an idea. He got up and started walking home. His mother, father, and brother were on the porch waiting for him. Slowly, he walked up the steps and said, I ran away. They looked at him. Where did you get all those things? Well, on the way, when I was running away, I said goodbye to Carl the garage man, Mr. Dimple, Bertha the baker, Mr. Pfeffer, Tom the shoemaker, and Mrs. Bird. They all needed my help, and they gave me these things for helping. Bernie gave the road map to his father, who said, That's just what I need to help me finish the plans for the big fair tomorrow. Bernie gave the high button shoes to his brother, who said, Oh, am I in luck? Just what I need to complete my costume for the big uh, fa fair pageant. The poor, four purple plums, bleh, four purple plums, the bunch of green grapes, the nice salami and sour pickle, the warm rye bread and cookies Bernie gave to his mother. Oh, you're so helpful, Bernie. Just what we need to round out our picnic meal at tomorrow's fair. Then Bernie's father picked up Mutt. You need Bernie, and Bernie needs you, especially when we get too busy. His mother smiled. We need help from one another, Bernie. But we really, we really need you to love. And she gave him a great big hug. Ooh, going to a fair. The end.